Harassment has been the topic of conversation for the past couple of years. We've even seen some of our favorites being exposed in the media. What we don't hear often is the harassment stories of the everyday person. 69% of people say they've experienced it at work. 43 have experienced it in social settings. 45 say it's happened to them on the streets. Growing up working in like the food service industry, working in the retail industry, harassment's commonplace. Customers harass you, the workers harass you. It makes one stop and think, where does the line of harassment start? And do people know what harassment means? Harassment means um, bothering someone, doing anything that is taking away their sense of safety. Ooh, unwanted attention in general. Trying your hardest to make someone else feel uncomfortable? Anything that makes another human being feel uncomfortable. It's clear most people understand what harassment means, but why does it happen so often? There's one particular time where I absolutely regret not going to HR behind something that a manager said because if they're doing it to me, how many other women are they doing it to? Yeah. I was in elementary school, I was really young, and there was this like guy that he was in his 50s, I guess, and he passes by and like he touched my like booty. <laughs> you were little? I was little, and then like I was, I didn't know what happened, yeah. and I just like turned back while he was passing by, and he just like gave me this like okay sign, like. Like, as if he's asking permission and like saying like, it's okay. Like I still remember that moment. It's just I think it starts with like microaggressions and subtle things that you, feel like, you shouldn't have said that. Recall even if they're your friends. When you're younger, it's really unsettling. It's really uncomfortable. You might not say anything. And as you get a little bit older and more comfortable, you realize it's not okay. Find your voice, and you can tell someone like you're not going to speak to me like that. You're not going to touch me like that. You're not going to ask me those questions. Um, it's important to not feel ashamed, but to quickly act and to reach out to someone who can help you. So it might not be something that you feel comfortable doing right away, but to tell someone that you're confident in that can help you actually um, get the resource that you need. There's no place for this in our society. Like, you don't get rewarded for bully behavior. As the conversation continues, men and women are learning more about what is and isn't okay in today's society. Survive.